Hi everyone and welcome to another video here on Jurassic Collectibles and this is a very exciting one. It is our first review of the new Dino Trackers assortment. You can see the 2023 packaging. We have got blue and beta on one side. The kind of orange colour scheme for the aquatic animal. We have got the ocean logo up here. A little oil rig behind it. And this is the Kronosaurus. This is a really, really gorgeous looking aquatic animal. You can see side on. It looks absolutely fantastic. Has a gorgeous aquatic colour scheme. And I really, really love the new packaging treatment for this. Stands out, jumps off the shelf. Ties in nicely to the Dino Tracker marketing campaign. And looks absolutely incredible. I will say shout out to the Chaos Theorem team for Dino Tracker. Really, really cool marketing campaign and it's cool to see it transferring across into the toys. So you can see this is a sound effect dinosaur. We've got a little guide on the play feature just there. We have got the Dino scan code that does return for 2023 and the rest of the Dino Trackers assortment just there as well and then some guidance on the base as well so this is really really awesome chronosaurus i really love that we are getting more aquatic animals for the mattel jurassic line i'd love to see a playset with an aquatic animal and a submarine at some point but for now getting them at this kind of scale the sort of traditional uh, what was once Roarivore scale is really, really awesome. So we've just taken out the little plastic tag for the electronics and we will now cut this figure out of its packaging. And you can see that right off the bat, the Kronosaurus, even without the tail plugged in, is a pretty large animal. And if we just rip open the case here to get to the tail a little preview of the sound effect there I probably could have done this a bit of a better way thinking about it but there we go we have got the tail just there all one colour with the white joint that connects in just here and we can see that with the tail locked into place. I don't know that it does. I'm assuming it goes in that way. That looks quite apt. We have got the Kronosaurus. So this is one cool looking aquatic animal. You can see we've got that kind of traditional uh, marine reptile kind of colour scheme. The blacks and the tans. Really reminds me of the Mer creature figure from Primeval, if anyone watching this had that as a kid. Looks really, really great here on the Chrono. Really, really strong colour scheme. You can see bringing it closer. We've got all the usual texture we've come to expect from Mattel. Lots of individual dots here to create this kind of really coarse effect on the dinosaur. And then you do have some little scars as well. There's a little scar just there, you can see. Just there, another little scar, adding some depth to this sculpt. You've got another little scar just here. Something which helps to make it feel a lot more lived in, you know, uh, aquatic creatures, animals, dinosaurs. We will come on to those sound effects. Uh, they all would have got in fights, so it's cool seeing that there's scars on this that make it feel a lot more lifelike, a lot more dynamic. You can see a top-down view of it. Looks absolutely fantastic. I am so happy with this animal. And some really nice patterning on the fins, as you can see just there. Looks gorgeous. And then the head sculpt. You can see some nice metallic green for the eye with metallic blue sort of highlights. White for the teeth and nice pinks inside for the jaw as well and that does look absolutely fantastic some really really great depth on that sculpt as well as you can see just there looks really really good we do like i said get a dino scan code on this one so you can see it just there 
and it tucks away nicely into the skin just there as well. And then as you've already heard, the main play feature is we can use this to make its neck twist and bite like so. And you can see that there. Looks really good. With a nice wide bite on this one and some cool play features packed in. So really, really nice Chronosaurus. The fins do rotate as you can see and they can go in and out a little bit as well. And beyond that, it is a very, very nice aquatic reptile. Very, very similar in size to the Lyplurodon, uh, but it looks absolutely fantastic. I am really, really happy with this one. So glad that Mattel are making more aquatic creatures, and I hope we see even more of them in the future. So that's really it, guys. That's my thoughts on the Chronosaurus. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, favourite, and subscribe. And until the next video, take care and have a great week.